Hi everyone, I'm Alicia Esposito, content strategist for Retail Touchpoints, and I have joining me right now Atul Batra of Menton. Atul, thanks so much for taking the time. My pleasure. So, we're here at NRF 2017, and you guys have this really cool device here that is set to revolutionize the way that retail organizations share information, get insight. Why don't you tell us a little bit about Maya here? Okay, so at Monthan, you know, we've been working on AI for a number of years. There's uh, broadly two areas we've been working on. The first area is what we call, you know, deep tech. How can we make our algorithms more intelligent, more powerful, more cognitive, if you will? You know, act like a human, right? The second area is, uh, you know, what we've launched at the show here is around something we call month and AI conversations. Basically, how do you make a human talk to a machine uh, in a very intelligent manner? You know, basically, there's been a lot of focus around, uh, you know, consumer use cases. So the likes of Google Home, Amazon Alexa, you know, Apple Siri. At Manthan here, we are revolutionizing how users talk to business systems. So it's a first in the industry, we believe. Secondly, we are introducing Maya, which is retail's first conversational agent for AI-powered decision making. So that's really, you know, the launch here. No, that's excellent. So what would be a potential use case? Like how would this work within the typical retail organization? So initially we are taking to the, to the C-suite. Uh, we believe that in the next 18 months, up to 40% of usage for you know, uh, CEOs, head of merchandising, head of marketing, will potentially happen through voice interfaces. So uh, we are launching Maya here as a way for a CEO to you know, get quick business updates uh, you know, without having to learn software using very natural language uh, interface uh, you know, in a very conversational manner, very interactive manner. And we think that it will really drive analytics to the next level, provide ubiquity in terms of providing business uh, insights to all users and roles uh, in the organization. Oh, that's great. So from an analytical perspective, I mean, what, what's, what's the depth and breadth of data that you know, this tool can not only read, but you know, analyze and, and really uncover those insights for the CEO so it doesn't have to do as much mining for information and doesn't have to learn all of those complex systems? Great. So basically, uh, that's a great question. This is going to uh, address the entire universe of the data in your warehouse and more. So you can bring in external data sources, you can bring in weather data, you can bring in news, you know, socioeconomic data. So it's going to, uh, you know, slice dice the entire data you have in your warehouse and basically be able to answer any business question that's pertinent to you. That's great. So you talked about, you know, the arrival of Alexa and, you know, Google Home. So how, how do you think, you know, Maya here and, you know, voice power technology, intelligent technology is really going to transform the future of, you know, enterprise solutions, especially as more millennials enter the workforce and hopefully move up within retail organizations. So like I said, I, we believe this is the first in, in the business world where a user is able to ask you know, business questions. Uh, we think this, this will really democratize analytics in the organization and provide a very easy new uh, you know, way of interacting with the business system. And you can ask your questions just as you, 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 know, you think of them, right? So you don't have to uh, log into the application, work through a navigation, look at reports and so on. You can just ask the question. You can ask, you know, why is sales down? Why, how's my store performing? So on and so forth. That's great. So, so with that, so would you be able to walk us through um, what an interaction with Maya would look like? Absolutely, my pleasure. So I'm going to play the role of Bill. Uh, Bill is actually a CEO. Uh, so it's Monday morning and Bill is, you know, making breakfast for the kids. Uh, Bill wants a quick sense of how business is going. So let's get started. Alexa, talk to Maya. Good evening. I am Maya from Manth and Retail Analytics, your virtual assistant. I can give you insights to power your business decisions. May I know who I am assisting today? This is Bill. Hi, Bill Smith. How may I assist you today? Alexa, ask Maya, what is my business update for today? Hi, Bill. The business update for January 16th is as follows. Net sales stand at $884,000. You have achieved 78% against plan, up by 15% against last week, with a gross margin of 23%, up by 7% against last week. Alexa, ask Maya, what are my performance highlights? The performance highlights for January 16th are as follows. 
Grocery is the top selling category, contributing 20% to net sales. The most profitable category is children's, with a gross margin of 39%, with a contribution of 38% to net sales. California is your top sales region. However, Illinois is your most profitable region, with a gross margin of 24%. Sales have declined at three stores. The Oak Court Mall store has experienced the highest decline. Alexa, ask Maya, why did sales in Oak Court Mall store decline? The main causes for decline in sales at Oak Court Mall store are number of shopper visits fell by 53%. Transactions also fell by 9% and 48% of key value items were out of stock. So as you saw there, we asked a why question. So, you know, Maya answered that, yeah. that sales was down and, you know, we could drill into what was the reason for that. Right. Alexa, ask Maya, what is my sales and margin for this month? Your month till date. Sales is $9.42 million and margin is 19%. Alexa, ask Maya which is my most profitable category. Your most profitable category is women's with a gross profit at 35%. Alexa, ask Maya which is my best performing promotion. Your best performing promotion is $5 coupon. So basically you can slice down into any data that exists in your warehouse. Uh, you can ask why questions. You can also action Maya to do things. So uh, Bill has got a good sense for you know business updates. Now I'm going to ask for a report to be emailed to me. So let's go for it. Alexa, ask Maya, mail me my performance summary report. Your report has been scheduled for delivery. Please check your inbox. Fantastic. So that was a brief demo. Hopefully you got a sense for the concept. That was incredible. Right. So you not only empower the C-level to get more insights right. you know, at the high level, right. but you allow them to get as granular as they want right. and get that instant access to information. Absolutely, absolutely. That's, well, this was fantastic. Thank you so Thank much you so for much. taking the time out to Thank join you. us today. Thank you. Thanks everyone out there for watching. This is the future of enterprise technology.